In the first season of One Hour Limit Locked, we set ourselves the challenge to get a fire cape in 45 days while only being able to play for one hour a day. I went 36 minutes overtime on the last day, but we got our cape in the end. The thing is, that was only the warm up. Now, we're really about to start cooking. 60 days are on the clock, 175 quest points are on the menu, 8 council members are in need of a charming knight in shining armour, and I'm the idiot they're getting. Welcome to season 2 of One Hour Limit Locked, it's chef in season baby. Hello there everyone and welcome back. This is one of those days where I'm not going to do a mad intro because it's 3.18 and I'm on the wrong profile. I'm sorry, every time that happens. Yeah, it is 18 minutes past 3, so man is, man is rushing to have this done before 4.20. I left it a little too late to start to be honest, but... I can't help that, I was having a spliff. I don't have enough inventory space. That is not ideal. Okay, there we go, we got everything from death. Uh, I'm gonna go do a birdhouse run, of course. I'm actually gonna remember today. And then we will carry on with the RFD and Monkey King. I'm gonna teleport straight to the G at the end of this birdhouse run. Get ourselves the Chef's Delight Mature that we need to boost. Okay, that is those reset. Just two bird nests. We've got a lot of herbs to sell as well, actually. Uh, I think I'm just gonna process these herbs while I'm here. Can't do that until yet. Haralanda, Taramin. Oh, I can't even do ear leaf yet. Lame. Okay, I guess I'll sell the ones that I can't do and keep the ones that I cleaned. Okay, a bit of cash back if this doesn't sell. This stuff doesn't sell, I can always lower it. We, what the fuck is that? Why is it in such a weird cup? What the fuck? Is that like a barrel of it or something? I'm gonna have to pay for this. Woo. 100k, please. Damn. Don't accidentally drink that. It's the most expensive beer ever. Right, what do we need now? We need our banana, or our snakes, our ninja gree gree. We might need the others, so I'm just gonna bring them all. We got everything. Uh, get some stams, some energies, and then the best way to get there, if we're going here on monkey agility cost, there's a fairy ring there, so we can just use our drim and stuff. Okay, I think that's about all we need. I'm gonna take the rune pouch just so I can teleport as well. Don't forget the chef's delight, of course. So there you go. Ooh, I can't remember what the code is. CLR. Right, so monkey one ninja. We're in. Oh, better not take another. Or well, what if I grind it first and take it? Yep. So I thought, bitch. I should have got more bananas, should I? No, I didn't really eat that. I only did one of them. Yeah, I need more bananas. Because I, I don't want to have to... I want to have three ready to go. Because otherwise, I'm going to lose this cooking boost that cost me fucking 100k. Like, I can't really afford to miss too many of those. So I need to make sure I go and get another red banana. And then I, I've got three, with three, should be relatively safe. If we fuck that up, then it is what it is. Why is that guy giving me a messenger? Uh, oh, it's King Lathus being a dickhead. It's a good job I brought this rope. Okay, and then we cut that, and then we do it again. Cool. Cut that. Use that on that. Use that on that. Perfect. Okay, now we need the zombie one. And we very slowly shamble down here. Right. We're gonna put preserve on. We're gonna drink this and go. 
I think we got it on the first try. I'm still gonna do the other two. Two out of three. In case anyone's curious on the rate. Okay, we can go and rescue Prince Awawuga. Probably unlocks our first, like, decent gloves. I don't know if it's, it'll be... I think this will be Rune, right? So they're actually not terrible, maybe? For Melian, at least. Oh my gosh. I can't do it without the monkey speak. It doesn't tell you you need the monkey speak. Amulet? What? 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 Is your name? King Come here, you bastard. Get free. So now I know how to teleport to Ibitol. And we get a beautiful 10,000 agility XP. Gets us a whole level. In fact, I need to take that tracker off. And we don't need that one either. We've got very few actual goals left now. In terms of, like, skills and quests. We are certainly getting there. Let's have a look. It's been ages since I went and got the gloves. So yeah, it's rune now. They cost six and a half K, so that's fine. And yeah, they give a melee strength bonus of plus eight. That's not bad. I don't know what it is in comparison. Yeah, it's better than a combat bracelet in like every regard. So very nice. I'm actually going to leave those on for now. And we are going to go ahead and move on to our next quest. We've got a few quests before we're ready to look at the next council member. And the first one of those that I would like to do is this one. I hit the other snake because I'm a king too. Okay, I think we got everything very quickly. We can't equip a D-Sim yet, can we? With 50 attack. Man! Wait, what's that new weapon? The Sulphur Blades, 55. God damn. I don't think there's anything really we can... Make an upgrade to in melee. Guess a brown saber, but they're probably expensive. Right, so apparently we need... Wait, well, do we actually need to start with seven coal and a tuna? Because there's banks there. So I don't need to worry about having everything on me. Storm And... Energy? Get the alks, why not? Cool. Let's go do some Fremenic stuff. We are going to go to Miscellanea and run from there. It's my best way at the minute to get to the Fremenic region. I need to turn the heating down. I'm getting sweaty. Okay. Jeez, these are some long-ass dialogues. Like, literally, they're just talking at me. If you were actually reading this, that conversation would have taken you, like, ten minutes. Just to, just to read that single conversation. Nothing but... I'm pretty sure you can wear other stuff, right? I don't think it matters. Okay, it wants me to take my other shit off. Okay, take off the Jester outfit. I mean, I took off two pieces of it, that's gotta be enough. Okay, gotta bring him this shit. Oh, now I just have to go and repair the bridges. They didn't just want me to bring them the shit, they also want me to do their work for them. Is this a bit where I should have? Yeah, I should have brought like a prayer book or something. Dragon Blood necklace as well. Cool. Okay, going back over to the other island now. Got to tax all this guy's citizens and be horrible people. Now we got to tax his citizens again because he is still a dick. I love being a tax man. Alright, back on over to Relica. Is there no altar? I don't have prayer. I don't feel like there is an altar, so I'm gonna have to go to like... I think I might have to go to GE anyway and get a couple of prayer pots. Because I know this fight can be probably harder than I'm expecting it to be. No, we have to go talk to the other king again first, apparently. Okay, I'm gonna go to the GE and get some proper potions together. So that we can do this. We want our melee set up as well. So it's gonna be climbing boots and glory. We, I guess we have a damage book. Like that's our offhand. I could probably just buy the pages. It's probably about time I did. Should we just buy the pages? Or is it, un is it called unholy? Yep. All right, there it is. Unpack, there we go. All right, we finally got our god book properly done. Oh shit, no, we need the niche not shield. I'm dumb as shit. Well, that's that anyway. <laughs> Fire cape, berserker helm. Looking pretty beastly, to be honest. 
other than the rune sim. What else do we need? What else do we need? Some prayer potions. I'm just gonna get two. And can we get a super combat? How much are they? Probably expensive. I think I'm gonna have to go regular combats. Wait, I've already got those. We need like some decent food as well. Swordfish though. Crampons. Yeah, I think that's gonna have to do. Okay, we need to get back there, but we've got a wealth, so that's how we're getting there. Same as last time. I reckon we should just about be able to get this done before the end of the session. And squeeze a birdhouse running into, probably. I still didn't recharge my fucking prayer. Oh my gosh. Alright. Time to go kill the Troll King. I didn't bring defense pots, I meant to bring defense as well. Okay. Kill ten trolls. Go for the tiny ones that are already damaged and then... Counts as our kills, I believe. Not that we are hitting at all. It's gonna be rough. And I can't really use offensive prayers because I don't have enough prayer. I'm gonna leave that prayer belly up as well. Range even, not melee. This is gonna take a while. Just one more. I'm pretty sure this guy gives us like food and potions as well, so I'm gonna go talk to him. Request supplies. Prayer potions? Does he give me more? Strength. The regular though. Oh, that's terrible food. Yeah, nothing really to get there. Just a bit of prayer pot. Right. On to the big buddy. This could take a while. You know what? I'm gonna be in such a rush at the end of this. But this feels like a good opportunity to roll my 420. Because this is going to take a couple minutes. No getting around it. It's already 4 past 4, y'all. We've got 14 minutes left to go. It's going to be tight finishing this. Ooh. Almost there. There he is. Decapitate. We can finally upgrade this Berserker Helm of ours. Wait, no, that's the wrong way, isn't it? I think I've done that before. It's like no exit over there. Alright, here we are. Thank you very much. Okay, so we get 10k XP. I think I'm actually going to take attack because we've already got our strength goal and as nice as defense is as well, our attack just kind of sucks at the minute. Like, I want to be able to use dragon weaponry. And that didn't, it only got me a couple levels there. Okay, 10,000 woodcutting XP, very nice. 5k crafting and construction as well, and the Nezi Helm. Look at all those levels coming in. We finally got our Nezi Helm. We can't wear it without a defense level of 55. I'm an idiot, I should have taken those 20ks on defense. We wouldn't have gone up there anyway, but oh well. Woo, that is another one done. I don't even know what we need for the next quest. Don't see any reason not to start it. We have everything. No enemies. Addy for the teleport. Dueling. Think we're good. Cool, let's go start this. The tent. Where is that? Okay, so we can BLS. Actually, first, let's uh, let's reset. Okay, go search this tent. We're doing a Garden of Death next. Main reason being that we need 30 farming for Enlightened Journey, which will get us a little bit of fire making at XP. And some crafting. It's quite a quick and easy quest. A good way to just boost your farming up. 10,000 XP, not nothing when you're at a... I mean, we've only got fucking 5,700 farming XP as it stands. Island. Are we going to a new f location? Yeah, I think we just got DJR, right? I don't know where we're going for the next one. I don't think we're quite going to finish this. I mean, we could, but it would mean not doing a birdhouse run, probably. It's a bit tight. Okay, one more ruins to do. I don't know, maybe we can still do both. Oh, that's fucking miles away. Uh, Zerik's lookout? Let's go. I don't, I didn't like, I didn't know which teleports we had access to. I feel like I'm probably running about the same distance, but... Oh, well. <laughs> Am I in the wrong side of a mountain range? No, that's the wrong side. I want to be on this side. Oh my gosh. There goes our birdhouse run. <sighs> Gonna try and, like, do the wrap-up conversation as I'm finishing off here. 
As I've mentioned, time is a growing short. We've had 65,000 XP gain today, not bad at all. 10k woodcutting, 5k construction, 20 attack, 10 each in agility and cooking, 3,000 in hunter and 5,000 in crafting so far. We may get another 10k here with the farming if we just finish it out, which I believe we should be able to. Oh, there's a few here. Let's go. There we go, 10k farming XP. All right, that's 31 farming, which means we can do enlightened journey now. I am gonna try, try and get a birdhouse run done. For some reason it won't let me teleport. An ancient magical force blocks my teleport. That was rude. That might have been the minutes that cost me. Oh wow, we don't have any dig site pendants. Okay, that's what's gonna cost me. We need to go and get some dig site pendants. Ruby necklaces, enchanted with cosmic. Ruby necklace, cosmic runes. We'll just get like 100. We might already have some, but cool. Having that shit in my invent will remind me to do it at the very start of tomorrow, so it's all good. All right. Yeah, I'm going to be wrapping this one up, folks. We've had 75,000 XP again today. We rescued another council member. It's been an absolutely fantastic day for the account. The monkey is free, all we have left to go now is ceramic vase after two more quests. Two more quests and we're onto ceramic vase, two more quests and we're on to the final fight. That's going to be all from me on this one. If you enjoyed the video, please do leave a like and a comment and subscribe. All the good, the beautiful stuff that helps push me into the algorithm. Other than that, look after yourselves, be lovely to one another. I will see you on the next one.